are interested in understanding how different foods impact our microbiome meaning the bacteria and other microorganisms that live in our gut. It has been estimated that about 100 trillion microorganisms live in the gastrointestinal tract, and they've long been known to be critical for the fermentation or digestion of dietary fiber, which we can't digest ourselves. But more and more evidence is showing us that they play a larger role in many aspects of our health. When we eat, we eat a wide variety of foods, they mix in our digestive tract, then we excrete the non-digested portions. And at that point, the foods are all mixed together. So how can we know what portion of each food was not digested? With a carefully designed paired diet approach, combined with mathematics, we were able to determine the digestibility of a single food in a mixed diet, something that's never been done before. And then we carried it further to understand the effect of those undigested portions on the gut microbiota. My name is Dr. David Baer, and I'm the research leader of the USDA's Beltsville Human Nutrition Research Center's Food Components and Health Laboratory. Dr. Novotny and I are co-principal investigators for this series of studies, including studies of walnuts, pistachios, almonds, and cashews. In our series of studies, we confirmed that nuts have lower digestibility of macronutrients such as protein, fat, fiber, than some other foods, and how that reduced digestibility affects the microbes in our gastrointestinal tracts. When we really understand mechanism of action as a scientific community, we can develop better dietary recommendations to improve public health.